Hi, it's Greg Payne here at Vanguard Motor Sales, and today we're in front of a beautiful 1967 Cobra replica, and I tell you what, one awesome build on this thing. Um, we're doing this video today for you so you can make a good, uh, wise choice on your muscle car investment. Check it all out. Um, don't forget to become social subscribers to YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook. Um, go to our website at vanguardmotorsales.com and there's a button right up in the right hand corner uh, you can click on. Um, come on up, let's take a look. Wow, take a look at how beautifully straight the paint is on this thing. Super nice job on this fiberglass job. Um, everybody knows that fiberglass is hard to get straight. Um, this car, we're suspecting that the build on this car is about 25 years old. Um, we're not sure what kit it is, who built it, but I tell you what, they did a fabulous job. This fiberglass is solid. Later in the video here, I'll show you. I'll put some weight on that fiberglass for you. And it is just as rigid as can be. Just a beautiful car. Now, we've uh, done a few upgrades of this car. We added these really cool hooker uh, poly stainless steel side pipes to it. And those babies have got mufflers inside them. Um, these gorgeous wheels. We've got 12 inches of rubber on the ground back here. Uh, this door pops open. We got a little latch right there. It's got beautiful leather interior in it. Um, just did an awesome job building the leather in this thing. Again, right here we go. Look right there. This car is solid as a rock. You can push on it anywhere. I mean, you could stand on that fiberglass. It is so strong. Let me grab the keys here and we'll get in the trunk. There we go, in the trunk. Beautiful trunk. They did a nice job with the carpet and leather in the trunk also. Not a lot of room in there, but you do have a trunk. Take a look at that gas fill. We've got the cool Cobra gas fill here. Isn't that cool? Solid aluminum, nice and polished job on it. Again, down this side, super straight. This fiberglass is strong, it's straight. This paint is gorgeous, super straight. And don't forget at Vanguard Motor Sales, we own all of our inventory, no consignments here. So you know, we take the time to go through these cars and make sure they're good cars before we even buy them. So that transfers to you guys, get a great car. We're not gonna buy anything that's not a good car. So we've got the Stuart Warner gauges in this thing. Uh, again, the, the dash is uh, wrapped in leather. Just done a very nice job. We put in a brand new low car shifter. Uh, we put in a brand new uh, rebuilt C6 trans in this one. Just one awesome car here, guys. Everything's done on this thing. It's ready to go. It's fun to drive. Um, again, I'm about six foot tall and about 235 and you'll see me driving it i fit in it just fine it's the automatic makes it a lot easier to drive you get your foot on the brake your foot on the gas it's ready to go you don't have to worry about having any room down there uh, when these things are shifting gears Hi, it's Greg, and now we're underneath this Cobra replica, and I tell you what, somebody did one fantastic job building it. If you take a look, this thing is all made with tubular steel. They've put gussets at every joint. It's welded tight everywhere, all the way around. Just one awesome build, definitely custom. Now this build is uh, definitely an older build. I'm guessing at least 20 year old build. Uh, we're not sure exactly when this car was built, but as you can see, they did the really cool thing here. They use this jag rear end, 
And this Jaguar end is awesome, guys. You've got independent suspension. You've got disc brakes. This car does have posi. They've made adapters, so we've got five lug wheels out there because everybody knows those Jags were four lug. So they really did a nice job installing that Jaguar end in this thing. And it handles fantastic with that independent suspension in the back. Come on up, let's take a look at what other goodies this thing has. The job on the frame, just awesome. Uh, they've cut the frame out here, this cross member for the drive shaft. They've built a really nice drive shaft loop here to keep everything strong and everything safe. Um, trans cross member looks awesome. Um, we've got one fantastic looking exhaust system here. We've got jet coated headers. We've put these, uh, these flexible pieces in here to keep the vibration down off those side pipes. Got uh, stainless steel all the way around. Uh, we've got stainless steel band clamps here. So if you want to pull these uh, side pipes off, this band clamp comes right off. Uh, one bolt, two bolts up here on the side. You can pull these right off, and these things actually have uh, the mufflers are inside the uh, side pipes here. So if you want to run open headers on this car, all you do is pull those out put all this stuff back together in about a half an hour you're running open headers on this baby and I'll tell you what sounds tough with those open headers it's got a fantastic sound just with the mufflers in there too just one awesome build here we got a low car shifter set up on this car uh, C6 transmission freshly rebuilt uh, just got it put in we've got a, a brand new Canton oil pan on this car uh, Real nice quality oil pan here. Uh, eight quart oil pan holds plenty of oil for that uh, 351 Cleveland up there making the power for this thing. Now we've got a Mustang II front suspension. Disc brakes up front also. All my uh, bushings and everything look good. Looks like the ball joints have been replaced. We've got rack and pinion steering. Got brand new gear going from the uh, rack up to the steering wheel there. All new uh, Borgeson U-joints. Uh, Just one awesome build here. Uh, we've got the remote oil filter here. Real easy to change the oil in this thing. Looks like some brand new lines going to that. An awesome build on this Cobra, guys. This one's not going to last long. A build like this, Tommy's going to sell it quick. Um, make sure you give him a call at 248-974-9513. We're going to take a real quick look at the meat on this thing. Up front, we've got 24545 ZR17s on some just awesome looking wheels. And then out back here, we have 31535ZR17s. And those knockoffs are, are not true knockoffs they're just a knockoff look-alike just a gorgeous wheel let's lower this thing down and take a look at the power plant take a look at that power plant guys just gorgeous uh, 351 Cleveland I always love seeing these Ford motors and these Ford cars just beautiful job here um, things got all kinds of power uh, we've got a uh, Excel distributor in it. We've got brand new MSD wiring on the uh, spark plugs here. Got a Holly carb. I uh, believe this one's vacuum secondaries. Got an electric choke on that thing. Radiator's in good shape. We've got an electric fan on the radiator. We've got a trans cooler down there. Beautiful coat of paint on that um, frame. And again, you can see that frame. You can see what quality went into building this frame. All the dish outs for the upper control arms are done real nice, all metal finished. Just a quality build on this thing. Then we've got this piece of polished uh, stainless steel to show off that motor where you got the hood up. You get a lot of attention in this car, guys. This is a really popular car. This one's not going to last long. Make sure you give Tom a call at 248-974-9513.
This Cobra is just a blast to drive. I'm six foot tall, weigh about 235, and I fit in this thing. I can drive it comfortably. Nice thing about the automatic transmission is all you've got is that brake and that gas pedal. Real easy to drive. Let us put this dream in your driveway. Now for the performance portion of this video on the 67 Cobra. All right, here we go on the Cobra. Fun to drive, guys. Uh, we got all the gauges here working. Looks like the volt gauge, our oil pressure, our battery gauge, our water temp. It's even got a trans temp, but I don't think we got it hot enough for that to come up yet. Speedometer works, RPMs work. Just a lot of fun to drive here, guys. There's some guys there in the landscaping business all gawking at us. Listen to those pipes. It's nice and loud, it sounds tough, but it's not so loud that you can't hear me talking here. It's a lot of fun to drive. Look down the hood of that thing. Looking down the racing stripes there. Look how straight that hood is and how flat those uh, beautiful curved fenders are. Just a gorgeous paint job on this car, guys. A lot of fun to drive. Nice fall day here in Michigan and we're cruising in the Cobra.